how to set up multiple email accounts on iPhone. Setting default email would not be possible if we would not set up at least two or three email accounts beforehand from which we could choose the default one. In our how to set default email on iPhone iOS 7 tutorial, we explain, well, just that. Right now, let's see how to add multiple mail accounts to your iPhone running on iOS 7. Go to Settings, then tap Mail, Contacts, Calendars. Under Accounts, one would normally see a couple of email accounts that are used on this iPhone, but since we didn't add any yet, the space is empty. This section of Settings is all about your email account settings. From Sync Settings to Time Zone Support, we'll examine it in detail in other HowTech tutorials. For now, tap Add Account to add the first mail account. Depending on the type of account that you want to add, you should tap different options. If your mail provider is not on the main list, say, you have your own domain name and mail, tap Other. The difference between mail options on the top and Other is that you'll have to add your mail server data by hand. While in email accounts like Gmail or Google, it's added automatically. We have two Gmail accounts, and so we tap Google. On the next screen, enter your email account details, name, email, password, and any description that you prefer. If you've done everything correctly, and if you remember your password correctly, you'll see the next screen with mail account features that you might want to sync with your iPhone. We guess you'll definitely want to sync mail, but the other features may not be necessary for you. For instance, we don't use Gmail notes, so we don't sync them with iPhone. Tap Save when you're done, and in a couple of minutes, your mail account will be added. When we go back to Accounts, we can see there Gmail. If you tap it, you'll be redirected to the screen where you can tweak its sync settings again and even delete it. To add the next account, tap Add Account again. Since we have one more Gmail account, we just repeat the same steps with one difference. While syncing the feature of this account, we don't sync contacts since both of our Gmails share the same contacts anyway. Now we have two mailboxes under accounts. Let's go back to the home screen to mail app at its button. The red little number on the top of the mail icon is the number of unread emails that have been already synced with your iPhone. When we tap mail, we see the page with both Gmail accounts. From here, we can send emails from any of our accounts, check and read emails, and do what we normally do on our computer. Back to the home screen. Let's go again to Settings, Mail, Contacts, Calendars, and tap Add Account. Let's add account that belongs to Other category. Tap Add Mail Account and enter New Account Data, just like you did before. Now, we're asked to enter incoming mail server and outgoing mail server details. Normally, your mail account provider should have this data, so just enter the server data and press Save. From here onwards, the process goes similar to adding other mails, from syncing features to fetching unread mail. You can add tens of email accounts in the way we've just described. Additionally, we have tutorials that deal with adding Hotmail and Outlook accounts. Sky is the limit. This was a How Tech tutorial. Like us on Facebook, love us forever, or leave us a comment here in the fields below. Thanks for watching.